What is going on, everybody? I hope you all are having a wonderful day. Today, we are on another fishing mission. And what that mission is, is it's kind of a Google Maps challenge. So, we have baseball games here in Nevada. And I decided, well, between games, what am I going to do? So, brought the rods. That's what we're going to be doing. And I've been looking on Google Maps, and I found three lakes... And I think that's three different spots that maybe we can potentially catch some fish. So, right now, we are at Katie Allen Lake. We're going to see if we can catch something. So, I went ahead, tied on a chatterbait. That way, we can fish fast because I don't want to fish in one spot too long. So, with that being said, we're going to go ahead and jump out there and see if we can catch something. I'll see you out there. All right. Well... We've made it to the first spot, and it's actually the dam of this place. I'm hoping that the that it kind of drops off right here. That way we can fish a little bit deeper water, because it is pretty hot outside, and it's middle of the day, so I'm gonna assume that the, I'm going to assume that the fish are moving out a little bit, but we're gonna start fishing along here and see if we can catch something. I don't really know how deep this is. I can't see the bottom. I would assume it's just a few feet deep. Throw a parallel to this bank a few times and then just start working our way down. There are definitely some fish up in here. I mean, I've seen some from a distance up in these rocks. Nothing big. By an oh, got one right there, right at the bank. Let's go. First fish of the day. Let's go. He destroyed it. Came right out of those rocks. Ah. There we go. First bass of the day. Let's go. See you, dude. Oh. He came right out of those rocks and absolutely destroyed it. I, was, I wasn't even ready for it. I was about to pull the bait up out of the water. Let's move on down a little bit. Keep on fishing. kidding me Why am I so garbage at casting gotta love it Finally made it to the other side of this lake. I was gonna wrap it up and move on somewhere else, but um, I don't have much time. Might have to fish the other two lakes um, here in just a little bit. gonna be moving on oh man I thought I had a bump right there so as soon as it hit the water kind of gave a bump bump Come on, one more fish, one more. Hooked up. It's fish number two of the day. I knew I had a fish bump it a couple times. Just 
Just a little guy. See you, dude. It's fish number two. All right, so spot one is in the books, and I would consider that a success. I mean, two fish, that's better than most of my days. I mean, most of the time I can't even catch a fish. But I'm going to continue this mission in the evening a little bit later, which will only be a few seconds for you guys, but it's hours later. All right, I'll see you then. All right, so we just pulled up to spot number two. Got same bait tied on. Um, we're still going to be going after any bass that are along the dam. That's where I'm mainly targeting is rocky points or just uh, where the rocks are. I don't know. That's just what I'm feeling today. So that's what we're going for. This lake definitely looks like you can catch them here and it looks a lot deeper. But let's see what we can do. All right. I'm gonna set a timer for 30 minutes. See what we can do. My main goal is to not get hung up in one spot for too long. Plus, I got an hour and a half drive back. So, let's try this little rock wall right here where this, where this overflow is under this bridge. This might be a good spot. I think if we're gonna catch any, it's gonna be somewhere along this right here. If not, I'm gonna say it's gonna be a bust. This is all pretty shallow through here. Just keep on moving. I don't know. I can get a cast right here. I think the other pond, the other, I think the other lake was definitely getting a little less traffic than this one, so it wasn't quite as dirty. I mean, I expect all this algae and stuff to be on top, but like there's beer cans in the water and the other place, I didn't see any trash in the water. about took the rod out of my hands. I don't think it was very big, but oh, freaking missed that one. Dang it, that might be the only bite I get at this place. I'm actually almost out of time too. So, I will pretty much just keep on walking, not really stop much unless I see something that I just have to fish, but the rest of it's looking like it's pretty grown up, and I don't even know if you can get to the water hardly. So, let's head to the car and go to spot number three. Starting route to Radio Springs Park. All right, 30 minutes on the clock. Let's do this. All right, first cast at the third spot. Spot definitely looks a lot like uh, this, the last spot we were at. Into the sun. Whoosh. I don't know if you guys see that snake swimming away right there, but I just noticed it. You know, I'm not gonna say that I'm afraid of snakes, but that one was really close. And I didn't even notice it. So, I ain't about that. All right, so I didn't really plan on getting the big camera out right right now, but you guys gotta see this. This is like lily pad nation, and I have to get a frog out and try this. Mm. 
Look at this. The entire thing is lily pad. So I guess let's get a frog tied on and try to catch something here on top water. I wouldn't complain if we did that. Maybe I can actually get it cast out there. Well, I hate to admit it, but we got skunked those last two places, and I really thought we were going to get a few more fish, especially since I kind of let it cool down a little bit. It's still a uh, nice 90 degrees, but, you know, I figured the afternoon bite was going to pick up, but it didn't. At least we do know now that if I come back here, fish at the first lake, not the other two. Or, you know, bring something else to fish with at the other two. The purpose of this video, you know, we always want to catch fish, but it is always good to get out of your comfort zone and go try different spots, especially if you have no idea if they're going to be good. That's why I like giving myself a 30 minute time limit, and if I go past that, that's okay, but about a 30 minute time limit and just see, see if I can catch anything. The first spot, really good. We had two bites within 30 minutes. and. You can't ask for much more than that. But the other few spots, I think maybe if you had more time, slowed it down, you might catch some, but you never know. But with that, we are going to wrap up today's video. Thank you all for watching. I hope you all are staying happy and staying healthy, and I will see you all on the next adventure. I'm out.